this quick and easy tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make this waste paper bin. So let's get started. So for this project you're going to need a piece of mesh and this is a fine gauge mesh and the holes in this or the diamonds in this are three millimetres or one eighth of an inch high and as you can see it's nice and pliable. So begin by cutting a piece that is 32 millimetres high and that's one and a quarter inches and cut it longer than you're going to need it. Take a piece of 19 millimetre three quarter of an inch dowel and wrap your mesh around. Make sure there's a bit of an overlap at the back and then trim that off. and press it together and then pull the mesh down so that 22 millimetres or 7 eighths of an inch is still on the dowel and I made myself a little pencil mark so I know how high up to go. Keep a hold of it and cut snips in the bottom. Just go around every sort of 3 millimetres or so. and then work your way around pressing the flaps onto the bottom of the dowel, keeping it nice and tight. Hold onto the join at the back and press that down onto your work surface so you're getting a nice flat bottom. And we're not using any glue in this project so this will also hold the piece together got any flaps sticking out at the bottom just press them in and then press down again. So there's our little waste paper bin. Now you can leave it silver if that suits your scene but otherwise you can add a coat of paint and for that I'm going to be using a black acrylic paint. So to paint your waste paper basket you can leave it on the piece of dowel and actually dab the paint on so that you're getting it into all of the little gaps. And don't forget to do the bottom of the bin as well. Once you've applied a good coat of paint to the entire bin, just tip it off the dowel like that and then you can just dot a little bit into the bottom of the basket. And that can then be left to dry. Once your paint has completely dried, pop your piece of dowel back inside and reshape the bin if you need to. So just press it around your dowel nice and tightly, press in the join at the back together so that it doesn't unravel and flatten it down at the bottom. And your waste paper bin is now ready to be filled. I really hope you've enjoyed the first of these quick and easy tutorials and I'll be back soon with another one. Until then, take care. Bye.